There's a big, big fight over police pay raises. Now, Fraser City leaders are demanding the city's money back. The controversy involves college degrees that officers bought online instead of earning them. 7 Action News investigator Bill Proctor broke this story last week. And, Bill, we are talking about several years of money paid out that council members, they now want that money back, huh? That's right. In some cases, almost a decade. This is actually the document we're talking about. Fraser City leaders said in the recent council meeting, though, that they want the cash returned. But a high-ranking police officer told the council they'd better get ready for a fight. Frazier Police Lieutenant Dan Kolke, a 22-year veteran of the police department, told the council and a packed chamber last Thursday he did an internal investigation concerning the degrees. The two items that we found, which you probably can't go into detail with this, is it's either a contract issue or a public act issue. The public act issue is a civil matter. It is not criminal. This is the public act Kolke is talking about. It's called the Authentic Credentials in Education Act, which became state law in 2005. It says in part that an individual shall not knowingly use a false academic credential to obtain employment, to obtain a promotion, or higher compensation in employment, unquote. So now, some city council members want the officers to pay back at least seven years' worth of educational bonus dollars. The degrees allowed the officers to get a pay raise between $1,000 and $3,000 a year. And the most important thing I've said right from the beginning is we have to recoup those dollars and, and somebody's got to be accountable for it. How we get them? I don't know yet. An associate's degree is required to become a Fraser policeman, but if an officer gets an additional college degree, they get paid more money. That's why some officers purchased a degree online for about $400 without having to take a class or do any work. The certificate says they have a Bachelor of Science degree with a major in criminal justice. It comes from Almeda University, an online operation on the Caribbean island of Nevis. The U.S. Department of Education says the university is not accredited. Fraser Mayor Doug Haggerty wants an outside agency like the Michigan State Police to look into the matter because... I do not believe that 12 officers all stepped off and made a erroneous decision to go get a degree from Elmira. There had to be something that was happening in the management structure, something that allowed them to feel comfortable enough to jump off on this. We just want to come to a fact finding. We want to come to a fair way. It's our tax dollars. But the lieutenant fired back. Looks like a civil matter based on his internal investigation. And then came the warning. Believe it or not, our guys are dealing with this and it can be handled, but they are talking to in the city if things go wrong. A possible lawsuit. Kolke didn't elaborate on exactly what could go wrong, but tomorrow night, Fraser City Council is set to meet again to discuss their options. And apparently on both sides, the options include getting a lawyer and going to war over this. Yeah, long road ahead, it seems, yeah. over this one, Bill. Absolutely. Thank you, Bill. Thank you.